Hey, Chris Ferdinandi here with another Vanilla JS quick tip. Let's get into it. You can use a for of loop to loop over iterable objects. That includes strings, arrays, and other array like objects such as node lists, HTML collections, and HTML form controls collections, but not plain objects. In a for of loop, you define a variable to represent the current item of the iterable that you're looping through. And so in this case, we're going to define sandwich to be the current item in the sandwiches array that we're going to loop through. And then inside the block, the piece between the two curly brackets, we can do things with the sandwich, which will be the current item in the loop. And in this case, I'm just gonna log it to the console. If I jump over to the browser, you can see how that works. So I get back turkey, tuna, ham, and PB and J. It's gonna loop through each item in the array and log it to the console. If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and maybe even share it with someone else who you think might enjoy it. You can also get my daily developer tips newsletter over at gomakethings.com where every weekday I share a new tip, trick, tool, or vanilla JS snippet to help you build a simpler and more resilient web. Thanks so much for watching.